Hello everybody, I'm gonna make another video. This time I'm not sitting on the left side driving, I'm sitting on the right side driving with this guy, with Cody. That? So I'm gonna show you how we drive in Australia. Check it out. during the week so it's not that busy but yes yeah, it's, it's uh pretty cool we're at this place called illito is that how you say it illito illato or illito it's a pizza place and uh you get beer here uh hot tamales is over there they got some good tacos had those the other day and uh yeah, if you see that orange thing over there, that's the uh, buoy. That's what you can jump off of and launch people off of. And the, uh, the wharf is uh, over there. So, yeah, we're going to go to that here soon. If you're lucky, you might see some six foot bats. Yes. Big bats. So, I uh, know there's some of these trees right here. So, hopefully, I can get some video of it before it gets too dark. Yeah, so that was quick. Got pizza. Check it out. Wedges and pizza. Yummy. Now we are. So we made it to the wharf part. I don't know if, do you want to walk over there? Yeah, might as well. So, check it out. This is Darwin Harbor. There is some tugs. And there is, I don't know what that boat is. It looks like a, so that looks like a, Ferry. It's a ferry. All right. Big ship, big ship, big ship. Whoa, that was a big one. All right, so we're going to go over here, check it out. So, me and Schillinger just figured out something. In America, when we're walking down the sidewalk, which side do we normally go on? We should go on the right. 
Yeah, going the right. Yeah. However, in Australia, they do the opposite. Maybe that's because they drive on the opposite side. Except for these people. Let's see. This may not be a good theory. I don't know. No, it's already falling apart. No, I don't think it'll fall apart. I don't because I've already so seen it see. happen plenty of times. Yeah. So, yep. I am now. So, look at this big old ship. This thing is humongous. Look at all that radar. Look at all that radar. Past Paley, looks like it's out of the water. I think it's out of the water. I don't know it could be. A lot of times they do that so they can repaint the, uh, the hole. The hole, yeah. I don't know if we're allowed to walk. No entry. Oh. Let me go over here. So, yeah. You can get up right next to this big bad boy. You want to walk up next to it? Past Paley Pearls. Wonder what that means. That is a magnificent ship. It's like a clam fishing. Clam clam fishing? So that way they can get pearls. I don't know. Looks like that gym down there. Is it? Maybe. I don't know. Now it looks like well, it looks like explosive symbols. At least flammable. Oh yeah, it's this sitting in the water. That's a big old ship. I guess it is. It might be a clam fishing ship. That's pretty cool. Yeah. Look at that big old tug. Now that is a tugboat. Yeah. Look at that thing. I don't even think Dan describes it. To be honest, Toyota has louvers, honestly. Toyota Civic. Louvers? Louvers? Oh, yeah, yeah. Like, like on a B52? What's up? Is that like on a B52? Not like louvers, like you put on like you know, your Mustang. Or... Look at the pipes off the bed. Oh, now, that's what we call it, exhaust. Look at exhaust. That's what I call exhaust. Oh, yeah. Exhaust. Holy exhaust. <laughs> wow. One more time. That's how you roll coal right, right there. <laughs> so this is the wharf. Let's check it out. Soda flavor. Yeah, energy drink. Cream soda is never meant to be made in energy drink flavor. So we're looking back on the waterfront over here. It looks pretty cool. Check it out. Check out the sunset. Now we gotta walk all the way back over there. Which is probably like a mile walk. I don't wanna do it. I don't. You give me a piggyback ride? I'll, I'll take a piggyback <laughs> ride. Yes. Gotcha. He's got me. Teamwork. Okay, so sitting up here at the top of the wharf, I don't even know why my camera just shut off. So, check it out. Look at all the pretty lights. 
Who is like being sunset? I do have to say that Darwin is a pretty chill place. And uh, if it wasn't that expensive to fly here, I'd bring my family here for sure. There's, it seems like there's hardly any crime. They could drink um, Island under the table. Yes. There's a lot of beer here. Beer is super expensive. How much was, how much was that beer? It was uh, six bucks. So about five American, roundish. Say about five bucks. Five bucks of beer. Yeah. That's about right. It's not bad. Yep. That's uh, what we're doing right now. So later. So we just tried to uh, go to the end of the dock, and it's a restaurant. Oh well, now to walk 3,000 steps back to where we came from. This is gonna be fun. See you later. So now that I'm on the way back, this is a pretty chill atmosphere. Everybody's just hanging out. I wish Shreveport had something like this. Oh yeah. Yeah, uh, every, this is, this is the waterfront, so we're all just hanging out, chilling, drinking beer, having fun. And this is just a, a week, a week night, so yeah. Yeah, so um, didn't see any bats. I'm gonna show you a bat. Those are freaking huge. All right, well, that was my afternoon going down to the wharf. Stay classy.